the diagram shows a suspension bridge. The shortest distance from the main cables to the deck is 5 meter. Show how an engineer can use the information given to solve the following problems through mathematical modeling. Question A. Determine the function that represents the arc of the main cable. So first, we draw a diagram to help us visualize better. This is the concrete tower, which is 35 meter. Over here is also 35 meter. We have the bridge, which is 600 meter. And in the middle here, we have the shortest distance from the main cables to the deck, which is 5 meter. So what we are going to do now is we are going to divide 600 with 2 and we get 300. Over here is also 300. So we have negative 300, 35, positive 300, 35. Why negative? Because we assume to the left is negative, to the right is positive. And here we have 0, 5. So this is our diagram. And next we are going to use the equation y equals to ax squared plus c. So in the diagram we have positive and negative. But we are going to use the positive value. So we have positive 335 and we label as x and y so now we just substitute into the equation y is 35 equals to a x is 300 plus 5 so 5 is our c and c is y intercept and we have our y intercept here so now we just calculate and we get 30 over 300 square equals a and we use the calculator and we get 1 over 3000 equals a now we have the value of a we just substitute this into this equation and we have y equals to 1 over 3000 x square plus 5 and that is the answer if the suspended cables are 20 meters apart determine the number of suspended cables needed on both sides of the bridge so what it means by suspended cables are 20 meters apart is that the gap between the suspended cable is 20 meters so now to determine the number of suspended cables needed on both sides of the bridge we just divide the length of the, the length of the bridge which is 600 divided by 20 and then we minus 1 why we minus 1 for example if i have a string with a length of 100 meter and i wanted to divide it by 10 parts what i do is i divide 100 with 10 and then I will get 10 parts like here 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. But when I wanted to find the number of suspended cable, I should count the lines here. So the line here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 there's 11 lines here but i only want 10 so what i do i minus 11 with 1 so i will get 10 parts and this is why you should minus 1 in your calculation and since the question wants us to determine the number of suspended cables in both sides of the bridge we just times to the calculation and then press calculator and you will get the answer which is 58. Question C. Determine the type of material that should be used to make the suspender cable such that the total cost of the cable is minimum. 
Material A. If the distance between the suspender cables is 15 meters, the first position of suspender cable, its distance from center, x is 0. This represents that it is in the middle cable. Its length of suspender cable is 5.0 meters. To find the length of the first suspender cable on both sides of the bridge, we need a times 2 its length of suspender cable, that is 5.0 meters. The length of the first suspender cable was multiplied by 2 because there are only 2 suspender cable in the zero distance from the center. For the second suspender cable, the distance from center is 15 meters. Since the second's length of suspender cable is not given, to find it, use the mathematical model that is, y equals 1 divided by 3000 x power of 2 plus 5. To find the length of suspender on both sides of the bridge, the length of suspender cable will be multiplied by 4. The length of suspender cable is multiplied by 4 if only the distance from the center is not 0. After we find all the length of suspender cable and both side of the bridge, we find the total length plus all the length of suspender on both side of the bridge to find the total length. After finding the length, it is then multiplied by 750, the total cost per meter. The total cost for suspender cables for material A is ERM 848,250. Then we will do material B, same as we did at material A. Material C. The answer is C. The total cost of the suspender cables is lower than A and B.